My name is Azric. So, Foofer uploaded a new episode to the series of the free game showcase thing. It's called Gridland. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, I want to actually start playing it after watching his video because it's it's pretty cool. Um, although I edited the thumbnail after it being like 45 minutes uploaded. Um, only because like I wanted the logo there, his special logo in the thumbnail. Anyway, you guys should check it out. It, his, his series is like bombing. Like he already has like three episodes in. It's, it's pretty cool. You guys should check it out. If you guys are interested, the card will be in the top right hand side. Go ahead and click that if you guys want to see the series. It's pretty cool. Also, I'm very proud. I clicked the video and uh, like at first like his, his videos uh, were bad quality because he wasn't using the, the right preset. But after I told him which preset to use, like, it was really nice. Like, I was super surprised. I clicked on it. I was like, oh, it's, it's quality. It's quality. I was thinking about the logo for Heated Heart. And I was thinking of, like, symbols. Like, wow, my, uh, my Azric symbol is like a triangle. It's really cool, you know? Like, with, like it's not connected. It's, it's really nice. Uh, then there's Foofers with his really awesome F with like that little like triangle inside of it and then his K right next to it. So it's like Foofer and Kane. Um, or like, fuck. So I woke up and I drew this. Um, I was trying to think of an R because I couldn't think of an R right here. Let me, am I able to switch the camera mid recording? Probably not. H-T-H-R. That's what I thought of anyway. Um, I, f I originally wrote this. But then I thought, that hourglass does not look like an R at all. No one will get it. So if I make it kind of weird like that, then people will actually get it. Plus, like, I'm going to write, like, HTHR underneath it that way. Okay, it's HTHR, it's heated art, everyone knows it's HTHR, you know. But I really like how I put, like, sideways hourglass for, like, the H. You know, I think that's pretty creative. I'm thinking, like, the HTHR logo that I always put, like, on the, uh, the bottom corner of every episode for example this one here i'm thinking of changing it maybe uh having that hdhr like the logos in there me and fufer had our first um our first meeting uh manager meeting and we're gonna try to do it every sunday and every meeting we're supposed to be talking about like uh the future what's to come look at analytics of the past week and figure out you know what can we do to improve the views prove the comments improve like subscriber base what can we do to improve our channel? Our first meeting, we, we worked out a lot. Like I had a lot of uh, a lot of notes. I think you guys will like it, just to make you guys a little bit more active, like with the comments and stuff. For example, this one. If you guys like, okay, this is this is the idea. This is the idea. Uh, I want you guys to guess who edited this video for a chance to be in a future video. I think that's pretty cool because everyone has their own editing style. Everyone like figures out. You know, I, I think it's obvious. To, for you guys to know which ones I edited and which one Fufra edits and which one Fang edits. Um, just by looking at the video, you know who edited what, you know? So if you guys do and the first one to actually comment the right answer in each video, uh, we'll have a chance, like we'll put their name in a hat and once a month or something, we'll pull from that hat and be like, okay, it's this person. He's gonna be in one of our future videos this month. Here you go, congratulations. We'll uh, put up a video saying this person wins. Great, and like, I think I'm gonna be saying it in our vlogs, and my vlogs, like which one actually wins. So if you wanna know who wins, keep an eye on that. Um, you have to watch my, my videos, so go ahead and subscribe, you know? Yeah. Wow. Uh <laughs> Everybody now has a role. Like since we're the managers and we know how to like market our company a little bit more, market our YouTube channel a little bit, we're always on the lookout to see who we can collab with next. Um, so I don't know where and who, but we're looking around, like we're watching YouTube videos and we're like, okay, this guy's pretty cool. We might just do a collab with him. You know, I think that's, that's a cool, a good idea. Um, I'm gonna try to contact eventually. Uh, I talked about him in one of my previous videos, I think, Cub Scouts. If you guys watch his videos, let me know, because he is an amazing guy, and I would love to play a game with him. I don't know what, but something. So, like, Fufu and I are the collab scouts. We're scouting for people to collab with, not Cub Scouts. We are Cub Scouts, but not us. Like, we're collab scouts. That's our role. Shut up. 
Next is uh, a communications um, manager, which is basically like a social media expert. So that person is going to be uh, posting once a day on all our social medias, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook. If there's a social media, we're on it and we're posting to it, you know, Twitter as well, everything. And Peyton is now that communications expert because she's really good with uh, like um, social media. The next thing is the Twitch. I talked about it briefly, but Fang is going to be the Twitch manager. He is like, that's his baby. That's his. He loves to put raw videos up, right? He loves to put like, uh, excuse me. Let's say he's playing a League of Legends game. He wants the full freaking game there. He wants from start to finish because some people like to watch like a full game. Like, how does he clear, uh, how does he get CS? How does he clear his jungle? What's his pathing? Uh, what's his, like, what does he get in the items? How much time does he take from here to there? Um, what does he do to pre-gank? Um, what's his, like, way of interacting with us in order to gank us? Because he's really fucking good at jungling, you know? If you guys want to see his perspective, watch his t Twitch, because he is there, and he is interactive, and he is, he's all about League of Legends, and he knows it way better than all of us combined. So, if you guys want to, um, look at him and watch his Twitch streams, you should go ahead and do that. I think you guys would really enjoy it if you guys like League of Legends. And then he's starting to play a little bit more Smite. So maybe he might, uh, you know, post some Smite streams. But anyway, if you guys liked the video, please hit that like button and comment down below and tell me who you think edited this video for a chance to be in one of our future videos. We will pull from a hat with all the winners of one month and the winner will play in a game with us in the next month. So go ahead and do that. And if you want to watch more of my vlogs and our gaming videos, please hit that subscribe button on the end screen, and I will see you guys next Sunday. Peace out.